We're here to kick off today's race at the infamous Circuit de Monaco. Drivers will need to be on their top form if they want to take home the win today. The prestigious Circuit de Monaco then. It's not all that dissimilar today to the layout that made its debut almost a century ago. It's two miles and 19 corners through the streets of Monte Carlo. And although the average lap speed of around 93 miles per hour is the lowest of the season, the tiny margins for error make it the natural habitat of the safety car. And a warm welcome, of course, to my co-commentator here today, someone of tremendous experience and insight. It's the man himself, Anthony Davidson. Now, can I get your take on Max Verstappen? Well, it was a really impressive lap in qualifying to get pole position, but are they going to be able to hold on to the lead into the first corner with so many quick starters around them? I'm also looking forward to seeing the different strategies in play today. Those who are starting on the red mark soft tyre are going to have a little bit more grip early on, but they have to make it count before that degradation starts to set in. With the race minutes away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. Max Verstappen put in a fantastic lap yesterday, and he starts from pole position. And Lewis Hamilton completes the front row. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Leclerc, Perez, Valtteri Bottas, and Sainz, Norris, Ricardo, Fernando Alonso, and Pierre Gasly, Ocon, Vettel, Yuki Tsunoda, and Raikkonen, Stroll, Giovinazzi, George Russell and Mick Schumacher, Latifi and Nikita Mazepin. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out. Then let's see who can prevail today.
This is your final lap, final lap of the race. You worked hard for that one. Congratulations. They've done it then. They've won here in Monaco with an emphatic performance and a victory they can be proud of for years to come. Tell me, Amps, how did they manage to achieve this win? Well, I honestly feel it was down to the driver and car today. I mean, we can talk driver skill all day, but if you don't have a solid team to back that, you're never going to get anywhere. When you hit that sweet spot of having both an excellent driver and an incredible car, that's when you see results like those we witnessed today. Ferrari are at it again. An excellent performance at today's Grand Prix, and they're certainly a team that know what they're doing out there. Charles Leclerc's points today take him to the top of the championship standings. So, Anthony Davidson, who would you rank as your driver of the day? Well, my driver of the day has to be Charles Leclerc. He was unstoppable out on the track today, weaving through the competition with ease. Well, Ant, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one.